motivation is it's kind of a strange word because it doesn't really mean what we think it means. We think it means that we're fired up to do something. We think that it means we're eager and passionate to make something happen. And we think that somehow we should just be able to turn on that eagerness and turn on that passion. But we can't. Because you just can't turn on passion. You can't just turn on the desire to execute a task. It just doesn't work that way. And honestly, that isn't even what motivate means. Motivate doesn't mean to yell and scream and encourage. The thing about motivation today is that motivation in a lot of people's minds have been made into a goal in itself. Now, motivation is not a goal. The motivation is the means to actually get to the goal. People come into me and say, I need motivation. They look down, they look almost depressive, and they say, I need motivation and, and I need it fast. Then I'll look them straight in their face and I'll say, what do you need the motivation for? A slight frustration might appear in their face and say, what do you mean what I need it for? I just need some motivation and then I'll figure out what I want to use it for. I will ask them again, what do you need that motivation for? Now, the reason I'm asking that question is, why do you need motivation if you have absolutely no idea what you want to use it for? So first of all, you need to find out the goal uh, or where you want to go or what you wish to achieve. And then you need to find out what's actually in that goal or in that state. And once you figure that one out, then motivation can actually be built up or generated that will bring you into that goal. To motivate actually means to provide a motive, a reason why. So to motivate someone is to explain to them why they're doing what they're doing, how it will help them, where it'll take them, why they should continue to work and to struggle and to fight. And when you need motivation yourself, don't look for someone to scream and yell. Don't look for someone else to give you motivation. Look at yourself. Look at yourself and remind yourself why. Why? you are doing what you are doing. Remind yourself that this struggle, this temporary pain, this fight, this fight that you're in, this is what will make you stronger and faster and smarter and better. And then with that motivation go forward into the fray into the storm into the heat of the battle where victory is forged motivation is the art of generating interest and if you think about it have you ever been motivated towards something you didn't have the slightest personal interest in? I don't think so. The thing about it is, if we do not take time to actually find the interest, to generate the interest, we will not get motivation. So if you're, in, if you're facing something that you feel you need more motivation to achieve, ask yourself this question. What's in it for me? Why is this interesting? And if it's not interesting, find out what kind of interest you can actually generate in order to achieve uh, that goal. Motivation is the art of generating interest. And remember one thing, it's always the motivated people that change the world. I dream about a world where people choose to be motivated by love. 
know, I think we owe it to ourselves to ask the question, what is my motivation for everything? We're all in the same boat. We're all here to help each other. And I believe that if we are all motivated by love, there's nothing we can't accomplish.